world's up. There's this place, the movie fan, and you probably want to know my opinion on the new Halloween movie. Don't worry, I will preview that next week. But today I will preview Slenderman. That's right, the theatrical Halloween themed movie review I will be reviewing this year is Slenderman. Because nothing is more horrifying than a bad horror movie. Alright, I will admit that was a lie. Bad comedies are far more horrifying. But anyway, normally I'd start my review by talking about three of my favourite characters of the movie. But fuck that, this review does not get that privilege. Wanna know why? Because the characters of this particular movie really are that bland and forgettable. Now the characters of the movie are basically three teenage girls. And you know what they all have in common? They are all incredibly fucking annoying. Not only that, but I honestly couldn't tell them apart since they really are that bland and forgettable. Now look, I understand that they are acting like normal teenagers. I didn't totally get that. But you still have to put effort into making the protagonist of the movie at least somewhat likeable. I mean teenage characters in movies can't be written well, but the ones in this movie really aren't. And because of the fact that I hated all of these teenagers with such a burning passion, I didn't care in the fucking slightest when they got killed off. Speaking of which, the biggest problem that I have with this movie is the fact that it's not scary in the slightest. And it's not only because I didn't like any of the characters. Even if I did like them, this movie would still be a spare. Because this movie brings absolutely nothing new or original. The horror villain is some mysterious guy, which isn't much different from all other horror villains that I have seen. Another problem that I have with this movie is the fact that it has a lot of disturbing shit. Now look, there is a difference between disturbing and scary, which is something that the makers of this movie clearly didn't understand. There is a lot of disturbing imagery in this movie, that goes without saying. But that's not fucking scary, it's just stupid. Another problem that I have with this movie is just how fucking predictable it is. There isn't a single moment in this entire movie where I didn't expect some kind of jump scares. And guess what, for a lot of the movie, I must try to predict that. When a horror movie is extremely predictable, it kills off any chance the movie has of being scary. Now I'm not going to tell you who the Slenderman actually is, so that will be spoiling the movie. But let me just say that he is nothing that you haven't seen before. Now it's time for my overall thoughts. This is, hands down, the worst horror movie of 2018. And considering that I have seen some very bad horror movies, that's really saying a lot. And for that, I'm of course going to give this movie rating two middle fingers. Well, guys, you is the end of the video. Thank you for watching. Have a great day and happy Halloween.